Oh boys, how are we all getting on and welcome back to another video now. I know it's another short video and believe me, I don't like the fact I'm doing so many short videos. But it's just because it's the time of year, it's cold. And this week especially, I haven't been fishing the canal. I've been trying the any for roach and pike and it's just not been working out. And I'm not the only one. I know I went to the shop today and apparently some coarse anglers and pike anglers came in and they're not having any success either, so I'm not alone. But I still got a good sized canal pike. My second biggest, I think, of the year on the Savage Gear Burbot. So I'm gonna play that first and then afterwards I am going to show you a load of new lures I've got. Heavy rod though, so it's not gonna go very far. Oh, it's bigger than I thought. Not bad, not bad. That's better than the one I got in the day, okay? Could be eight pounds. Ah, a good sized pipe for this canal. Way bigger than thought. Right. It's 9.37 with the net, so that's seven and a half pounds. Here we want to have the competition. It's got something like a road or something inside it. Full of leech. Look at that, absolute sex bomb. Big fish catcher. I'm definitely gonna buy a few more of these since they're still in the shops. So that was a very good fish to get. And I only had like 20 or something minutes fishing, so not a bad result. But it was the only fish I think I caught in about a week's time. So to make up for that, I have got myself a load of new lures and I've also bought myself a soldering iron, so I've been fixing up a lot of my old lures, like here is an old burbot, I just put a bulldog tail on the back to fix it, and here is a river roach, and I've just put on a tail there, and the soldering iron I used to fix up my cut up lures, like the pig shad from last year and all that, so brilliant tool, and it's been really saving me a bit of money. The main lure, what I'm going to be using in the cold months, is a spinnerbait so i got myself a savage gear debush and i have been using this on the canal and the river and i've not had anything on it yet but i love the action and the great thing about it, it comes with two blades it comes with this one which is for slower moving and it comes with this one for fast moving i just use the little clip system so yeah i really like this and i'm definitely going to get some fish on it i just have two five gram ball weights there to for the river but uh brilliant as well as that i've got myself Good few pig chads. I got the blue one that done me the best last year. And I got two spot bullet colours. This one's a bit of a lighter one for murkier water. And I've made all these traces myself. I make everything now. Shad traces, dead bait traces, I make them all myself now. But here is the old pig shad that done me very well last year, coming my most 10 pounders of any other lure. I made my own shad rig and I made my own spinner blade bit there, which was just made out of a bit of wire from a fence. So that's the whole purpose of that, so. I also got myself a new burbot. This is a golden burbot because, well, as you saw, <laughs> they work. So I decided to get another one of three colors now. And I got myself the big Merce Mouse because the small one does me well. Spot Bullhead's a great color. And I know on the river, especially just after the winter, these are going to do very well. So I'm definitely going to use that. But that's not all I got. Uh, I got myself a new reel because, uh, my current Skyliner I am using for my roach fishing for the winter, so I have mono on that now. So I put the braid on this, it's a Shimano 
thing that it's, it's quite a cheap rate. It was only 30 euro and it's lovely and smooth though for it and can't wait to use it. So yeah, just a normal spin reel, but I might do a review on it if you want it. And the last thing I got was a big size guppy in gold and perch. Main reason it was the last one in, so I decided I'd, I'd pick it up and I love it. So I've got quite a few new lures and a lot of these are going to be used for the winter. I think you already know, but I do have the the big roach, so that's going to be used as well. But yeah, I look forward to using all these lures and I'm sorry it was a very short video, but it's just because the fishing's hard. Um, but anyway boys, I will see you very soon in the next video and see yous.